Alright, so today what we're going to be doing is looking at some more dumb ban appeals and the theme for the ban appeals today is people just not reading the rules and getting banned for things that they assumed they were allowed to do, but as it turns out, no, it's against the rules. So yeah, I guess the moral of the story of the appeals today is always read the rules of a server before you do something stupid. So uh, yeah, if you guys like this video and you like what I do here, please make sure to hit the like button and subscribe right now subscribe do it notifications turn them on let's go appeals now yay what is the reasoning for your ban i was cheating i assumed that cheating was allowed here why would you assume that why should you be unbanned i didn't read the rules so i never saw cheating was against the rules so you should unban me i don't understand the stupidity why in the world would you ever think that cheating was you know not against the rules and if you follow me on twitter then you'll have noticed that i sent out a tweet with that quote and uh, my favorite response to my tweet was Lauren replying with that uh, Arthur meme. This sign can't stop me because I can't read. And uh, yeah, there you go. I guess that's good. They can't read the rules, so they think they're safe if they never read the rules. But uh, nope, that's not how that works. Denied. Moving on. Why should you be unbanned? I don't know what happened. I think my mouse broke. For a second, my mouse started clicking all on its own, and once I got banned, it stopped. Wow, how convenient that your mouse just happened to break. Auto-click for you you at uh, about 120 clicks per second and then magically just stop the moment you got banned. What a crazy coincidence. <laughs> and before anybody says it, yes, I know there's a glitch in Minecraft where, where, you know, you can be automatically swinging without pressing your mouse. That's not this. And I know technically mouses can break that this could maybe happen. But come on, guys, work, work the odds here. The odds of that happening where it just happens to break while he's online. Auto clicks at 120 clicks per second, then magically stops as soon as he's banned. And yeah, this kid's just lying. It's a horrible lie, really. Let's go on to the next appeal. What is the reasoning for your ban? Cheating for the win. Pretty sure he meant to say BTW for by the way. I buy this on one Croatian web store and I'm banned for cheating on Evadalance. Can I get an unban? Why should you be unbanned? I buy this on one Croatian web store and I'm banned. <laughs> Why would you type like that? That's so weird. And also for anybody that doesn't understand, what he's saying is he doesn't have a Minecraft account, so he just bought, you know, like, I guess a hacked Minecraft account. You know, he bought it for super cheap on some shady web store, but that account just happened to be banned on Invaderlands. And now he's asking for it to be unbanned, which, uh, pro tip? Don't buy Minecraft accounts on stupid little shady websites. Because odds are that account is going to be banned on Minecraft multiple servers and most servers like Invadelands, we're not gonna unban you if you say oh i didn't have access to this account i just bought it that's a dumb uh excuse to get unbanned and we're not gonna unban you just like most servers won't you want a minecraft account buy a real minecraft account you can't afford one then don't be surprised if your account's banned on multiple servers next appeal here what server did this ban occur on i don't know that's some great information thank you what is the reasoning for your ban i don't know i have just started playing does he know anything? Why should you be on med? I have just started playing. Uh, I guess the best part of this one is if you scroll up, he made a poll on his ban appeal. The title of the poll is B. You can either vote for option J or option M, and he is the only one that voted on this poll, and he voted for option J. So, yeah. I don't even know what this appeal is. I checked the IGN. He's actually banned. It's a real account. I mean, I don't think it's a troll appeal. I guess it could be, but it's the most sorry excuse of an appeal I've ever read. Oh my gosh, what an idiot. Next Next appeal, what mods do you have? I don't really know how many mods this server has, so I don't know. <laughs> what? I asked for what mods you have, not what plugins the server has. <laughs> What? That is the dumbest reasoning ever. What server did this ban occur on? I don't know. What is the reasoning for your ban? I don't know. What's with people saying they don't know? What is that the new theme for appeals? You just say, I don't know and hope to get unbanned. Why should you be unbanned? I did hack, but then I did not hack. I got banned when I did not hack, so I should be unbanned. Thank you. This is actually kind of a common appeal. I mean, not really that common, but I've seen it so many times where people will say like, hey, I used to hack, right? But then I didn't get banned, but now I'm, I'm just totally not hacking anymore. And I just happened to get banned. So you should unban me. No. <laughs> 
You have no credibility at this point. You've just admitted that you used to hack. I mean, what? Why? Okay. S stupid people, stupid appeals. Moving on. Next appeal. What is the reasoning for your ban? I got banned for hacking. I don't know how. I was fighting some guy and I was lagged as heck. Yes, he just censored heck. Why should you be unbanned? Because I didn't not do something wrong. He literally just said, I did not not do something wrong. That's great grammar. Love it. And so, I mean, all in all, not too crazy or not too dumb of an appeal. However, if we scroll up, what clicking method do you use? Auto clicker. <laughs> So he literally just started using an auto clicker on Evade Lands without reading the rules, assumed an auto clicker was allowed, and got banned, and is now making an appeal saying, Oh, I totally didn't do anything wrong, guys. Please read the rules. Oh my gosh. And also, why would you even think an auto clicker is allowed? It's not allowed on the majority of servers. Stop being an idiot. Ah! Why should you be unbanned? I didn't know that advertising a Minecraft server is bannable. Read the rules. Please just read the rules. Oh, he even goes on to say, I read the rules a long time ago and I forgot I'm not allowed to advertise. How is that something you forget? I can't think of a single Minecraft server that allows you to advertise. Why would you assume you're allowed to? Okay, read the rules, please, again. What is the reasoning for your ban? Ban evasion. Well, why should you be unbanned? I did not ban evade. It may seem strange, but I used an alt generator to get more kit daily and kit default, and some account was blacklisted. Can you please read the rules? I guess this is a lesser known rule, but if we take a peek at the rules, under specifically kit PvP rules, no using any alt accounts to get daily items or gear or currency for you or any other account to use. His excuse to saying, no, I didn't actually ban evade, is admitting to breaking a different rule. Imagine you get accused of robbing some house and you're like, no, I didn't rob that house. I was across town robbing a different house. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? His excuse for not breaking one rule is that he was currently breaking a different rule. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so dumb. And then the rest of his appeal doesn't even make any sense. Like, I literally have no idea what any of this means. Let's just read it. You're not gonna understand it. The alts that were Blacklister most likely made Apex Wasabi think that I was the one that was ban evading those accounts. But if I was IP banned and I still be able to join again why would i need to appeal now what <laughs> okay i don't know moving on what is the reasoning for your ban the server hate me i did nothing wrong i shouldn't be banned please unban other than use hacks i did nothing wrong lol did he just admit to using hacks? I didn't notice that the first time I read this appeal. I shouldn't be banned, please unban, other than use hacks, I did nothing wrong. Yeah, he literally just said, other than using hacks, I didn't do anything wrong. I am sorry for hacks, please unban me, I would like to play, thank you. And then he replies to his own appeal, saying accepted. I don't know why so many people do that, but they do. Literally so many people reply to their own appeals saying accepted. I, I don't understand why. And also, I checked the history of this account. He was banned over six months ago, right? Now, this past June, we had a ban reset. So everybody that was banned got unbanned. And he was one of those people. He got unbanned in this ban reset and has not been banned since June. He hasn't even tried to log on since then to see if he's got an unbanned. He made this appeal not knowing he wasn't banned. I checked when he was last online and he was not last online since before he was banned. I don't even know how he have found the proper place to appeal, right? Because if you're, hang on, to ban myself for one second, right? It says you need to fill out an appeal at this link. How he found out where to appeal without looking at this ban screen? I don't know. We actually handle a lot of appeals like that where people aren't banned anymore, but they don't realize. I want to believe this is a troll appeal, but some people are this stupid, and at this point, it's just hard to tell what's a troll and what's real, because so many people are just dumb. And that was it for the appeals, so let's just take a look at one dumb mod application, because I just love dumb mod applications. They're so funny to read. So to start off here, what skills do you feel you have that will help the community? I'm not really a skillful person, but if there is someone who needs help with something, I can forward it to higher staff. No. <laughs> 
That's not your job. As a staff member, you're supposed to be the one that helps them. You're supposed to be, you know, skilled. You're supposed to know what you're doing. He just wants to basically be a middleman. I can almost guarantee you that he the only reason he's applying is because he wants to meet Skeppy. Because, uh, again, throughout the rest of this uh, application here, he's going to say, I'm not really skilled. I have no idea what I'm doing. Hire me. <laughs> What past moderating experiences do you have? I haven't been moderator on any server before. I've applied for servers, but I was denied. Again, he has no experience. And why would you even mention that you applied and were denied? If anything, that only hurts your chances. <laughs> if no other server wanted you, why would we want to hire you? What languages can you speak fluently? Just English and partly Portuguese. Well, I'm not certain you can even speak English that properly, as that's gonna be proven in your next sentence here. I work a job and go to school and will properly only be able to be on for three or four hours a day and will try play on the server five times a week. He meant to say probably only be on and he said properly and there's 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 too many other mistakes to even mention. I'm sure you guys caught him. And then also why do you think you would be a good fit for moderator? I think I would be a good fit for moderation because I've always wanted to be able to help people. How are you gonna help people? You literally just said above if people want help I'll just forward it to the higher staff because I have no idea what I'm doing. So overall, just an incredibly dumb mod application. This kid has no skill, has no idea what he's doing. And again, I can almost guarantee you he just wants to meet Skeppy. That's the reason why he's applying. And it's just, okay, it's just embarrassing. So anyway, if you guys did like this video and you like what I do here, please be sure to hit the like button, consider subscribing. And uh, yeah, um, I guess I'll see you guys uh, tomorrow, I think. Yeah, tomorrow. Um, so yeah, bye!